Decided to go for a really crisp, frosty walk. It's so cold, but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Ah, oh. not having Murphy here for a while because he's at Lottie's and Tom's. It's like it's really weird. You can go like an entire day and you don't actually go outside. And I just stepped outside the boat, and it was so frosty. It's like it's so magical. So I've had to come for a walk just to soak it all up. Because obviously, winter time, we spend more time inside on the boat than um, I suppose like you normally would in a house. Like you forget how beautiful it is outside all like all year round. It's just glorious. Look at these perfect, perfect leaves. Just given. A beautiful, beautiful frosting. Like Mother Nature is just so special. I think it's time to go back in and get myself a nice pot of coffee. Hopefully it'll still be hot in my um, in my cafetiere. Yeah, time for coffee. And why, tell everybody why we don't want a Christmas jumper because everyone goes, does it cut, get cold on the living on a boat? Oh no, it's, it's 20, 27 degrees down 27 there. 27 the degrees in the and boat. That's where the stove is and at the other end, 70 feet away, it's 19 it's degrees. It's 19 degrees so, and about, it's, it's, and it's drier than a house. Minus six outside. <gasps> minus five, minus six. Hi me. So. I'll prove this. Down here, it's 48% humidity and 22.4 like temperature wise yeah, not so frosty vlog and then down here oh my god it is 26 26.5 and 33 percent humidity so we are drier than a house so i'm just heading into town 
because I want something sequiny for Christmas. And so I'm gonna have a look around the charity shops and I thought I'd take you with me. I saw some amazing things and this jumped out at me. This is an All Saints little tiny sort of like overdress. Sadly, I picked it up and it was a bit too big and then I found this beautiful bag and it's gonna haunt me because I didn't buy it. Very frustrating. But there's so many amazing things in charity shops. I'd highly recommend searching in these sort of like thrifted places before you go and buy new. It's one of my things that I always say to all my styling, styling clients, always try and go and have a look and see if you can buy pre-loved. It's cold, it is cold. It's like minus six outside and I'm turning, actually I don't even need that on. I am, I am turning the fire up. I might even put a heat log on later. We have these heat logs and they kick out a serious amount of heat, the heat logs. Um, and one might have to go on later because it is cold, cold, cold. I don't know what it is, I've got used to the boat being so warm. Step outside and see frost outside, it's quite shocking. We are toasty toasty, but it is cold today. Oh, I can't wait till we have it gas. This is very annoying. You put it on the soup setting? Yes! Mm. It's just, it shifts itself about, no. you can't leave it. It function. Right, whoa! Yeah, that's the magnets in it. <gasps> it's just mad! You couldn't ever leave it. See, whoa! I don't like it. Give me gas again. Here's my outfit of the day. I might even wear this for Christmas day. I have bought, I think this cost me about four pounds on eBay, um, this lovely little River Island dress and it's got a little bit of lace on the bottom of it. And I have just paired it with one of my H&M cashmere jumpers. I love the look of the All Saints jumper dresses over like, you know, jumper, like the two piece, but I was not gonna pay 200 pounds. So I waited and search for a slip dress with lace and I've just worn it one of one of my longer jumpers and my boots are ASOS I've had these since last year so I think they're ones that they do all the time and then I've just curled my hair a little bit like I normally do with my air wrap I just filmed something really exciting and I hope that if you go and see it you will love it as well. I've just done the before and after video, the renovation of the boat, and I cannot believe how much we've done in the year. So if it's not up already, I think it's gonna be going up either in the next video, make sure you check it out. I've set it as a premiere, because I know a lot of people wanna watch it who are doing up boats at the moment, or want to do up a boat, and I hope that gives you a bit of inspiration. But check that out and look out for that one.
today I'm doing our Christmas shopping because we have Lottie and Tom coming this weekend, which is really exciting. Haven't seen them in um, a couple of, I want to say a couple of months. You probably saw them come when we did the purging of our name. But I'm off to go into town now. So I am just heading into town and I thought I'd show you my outfit of the day. So I'm wearing a pair of Amazon leggings, my Zara boots, which I absolutely love. And I am wearing a Greenwich Holland Cooper jumper. This is the gray one with that silver buttons. One of the most snuggliest cozy jumpers. I have these in a few colors. I've got this in a, a black and a navy as well. And then on my head, I have a new vintage Marks and Spencers hat that just turned up. It is lovely. I love these. I've got this, you would have seen in other videos. I've got this in like a, a tan color, but I love this so much. So this is my full look. I'm wearing it with a Zara bomber jacket and my Amazon rucksack, because I know I can get a lot in this and I can do a lot, a lot of shopping. Out for a good like three hours and the fire is still going. Found these as well, like these little tiny, I think they're meant to be um, like trim to put around a present. I'm gonna put it on the Christmas this tree. Is so pretty. My God, this is so nice. How cute does that look? That is literally the sweetest thing ever. Christmas tree. That looks so pretty. It's given it kind of just like a little bit of extra life and a touch of colour. So sweet. So after I decorated the tree with the miniature baubles, it was time to start wrapping the presents and I am so pleased with how the Hessian ribbon turned out. I think it is really pretty and it adds just such a little sort of like rustic effect to this really pretty wrapping paper. I'm so pleased with what I've got. I will probably go and pick up a few more bits, but this is just what I got today and I'm really, really thrilled. The fact that I've actually started the Christmas shopping because normally I'm really good and I've left it really late this year. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably one of the hardest things I've ever wrapped up because it had so many silly little corners. I think it looked really, really pretty in the end and I hope that it doesn't give it away what it is. I hope you guys have the most amazing Christmas and I look forward to filming more in the new year, but make sure you check out tomorrow's video because we've got the reveal of our before and after of what our boats looked like over the last year.